While the heat wave of the year continues for much of the United States with feels like temperatures at 3 p.m. mountain time and triple digits in many areas, especially along the eastern coast, we're seeing 102 feels like in New York and 108 degrees feels like in Washington, D.C. But things back here in Great Falls are definitely a lot milder. We're seeing 60s and 70s as of 3 p.m. mountain time, but we are all clear. Nothing but wall to wall, blue skies and sunshine out there today. Even a few areas in the 80s right now. That's because of this um, upper level ridge and high pressure system that started to move in today will continue to bring in a big warm up many areas back in the upper 80s lower 90s by Monday we're going to continue to see that trend here over the next few days with those temperatures now looking at our temperatures tonight we actually broke another low temperature in Great Falls tonight or to this morning um, it's been very chilly in the mornings, but we are finally starting to see those temperatures get a little bit back more closer to average. We're seeing upper mid to upper 40s and lower 50s in north central Montana. Tomorrow's forecast, though, many areas seeing 90s and partly cloudy to mostly sunny skies, 86 in Lewistown, 92 in Helena, 88 in Glasgow. Now, tomorrow we are seeing pretty fair weather in the morning here but we are going to start to see those clouds start to creep into western montana as we head into the later afternoon we could also see a few showers or maybe even a thunderstorm or two move in as well you can see them moving into southwest montana and moving towards the capital city here about 6 7 p.m tomorrow but there's looking just very isolated and not going to stick around too long but then seeing more um activity along the rocky mountain front as we head into monday evening so looking at tomorrow our severe weather outlook areas in light green could see some non-severe thunderstorms and then that area expands a bit on tuesday including great falls lewistown billings haver now we are going to be seeing those very hot temperatures throughout the work week staying in the 90s upper 80s pretty much all work week and into the weekend so if you uh, have been missing summer so far well it's pretty much here but we have been pretty wet and um, mild so far this summer which obviously we haven't seen many fires break out yet but once that's um, that fuel dries out and it will dry out very quickly with these temperatures. That's when we're going to start to see things get a little bit um, risky here with fire season. We are seeing those winds pick up Wednesday and into the end of the work week. So we just got to keep our eye on seeing how exactly dry the relative humidity will be. And we'll obviously keep our eye on that over the next few days. Right now it's looking okay, but that could change. Um, we'll keep you updated online and on air.